everyone and welcome to the Better Everyday YouTube channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Randy and if you are normal, like watch my videos normally, I haven't been wearing the same shirt the whole week. I just, I'm recording pretty much the whole week at one time because I only get so many times during the week that are quiet and without children. Usually more often than not, it is at nighttime. So I'm recording my whole week this evening on Monday night because tomorrow is schoolwork day. Wednesday, I have to take my son to an appointment. He just had surgery. Thursday is schoolwork day, but it's it's like that for my whole week. So anyway, recording them all tonight. So sorry if me wearing the same shirt for an entire week bores you. Anyway, so Sabaton. I have liked everything I've heard by Sabaton so far. Last week, I watched No Bullets Fly, and I love that there is that the historical context was also provided with the music video. And so this was recommended by a lot of people night witches and it is the animated story so it's i guess gonna have some of the context as well and then after this when i do sabaton reactions i'm probably going to watch the history video with a music video so they go together depending on the time uh, the total time between the two of them so uh let me know where you think i should start i do have some suggestions already from people but i don't uh, know if there's like a specific one that would be best to do first. If not, I'll go to whatever the earliest video was that they had. Anyway, without further ado, let's check this out. The Germans are resting behind the lines of the Eastern Front. Their tents in neat rows. All is in order in the quiet and still of the night. It's cold and the winter snow crunches under the jackboot of a guard. Looking up into the sky, the snow starts to drift down. It's peaceful here. Was that a noise from the sky? No, it's just the wind. Suddenly, piercing the still of the night, there's an otherworldly scream and a whoosh as a dark form speeds by. And was that a woman's laughter in the distance? There are no engine sounds and the suddenly fearful German soldier loses his footing and whispers under his breath, Die Nachthexen. The world is all at once a bloom of fire and ash, and two more dark forms pass without a sound. When I saw the uh, the video titled Night Witches, I thought it was like actual witches, you know, like broomsticks, pointy hats. I didn't even think about it. I should have known that it was planes. Okay. Of fire and ash, and two more dark forms pass without a sound. Hearing the whooping and celebration of these supernatural creatures, the guard shakes himself from his fear and calls out, Die Nachthexen! Die Nachthexen! The Night Witches! In the sky, above, three planes of the soon-to-be-famous 588th Night Bomber Regiment, their engines now running, turn east for home. Time to rearm and refuel for another mission. They turned off their engines when they got close. Coming into land, they're greeted by their commissar, Yevdokia Rashkevich. The young girls that form the pilots and navigators are between the ages of 17 and 26. They are wow. desperate to take the fight to the Germans and have traveled from all over Russia to join the all-women regiments. The 588th is where the least skilled of all the women are placed. But that didn't stop them from carving their name in history. In the early days, they were largely ridiculed by the Soviet men. Given men's uniform... I was going to say that hasn't changed, but it has for uh, some men, some men not so much. That is, I did not know this. This is awesome. This is awesome. In the early days, they were largely ridiculed by the Soviet men. Given men's uniforms that were too big and shoes all of the same size, the women did the best they could with the clothes, making them fit with belts or filling the large men's shoes with stuffing. Yeah. The equipment they were given was woefully out of date. The Polykarpov PO2 was a two-man trainer, underpowered and made of cloth and wood. These old string bags were nicknamed crop dusters, or even worse, sewing machines due to the noise their tiny engines made. But the women of when there's a will, there's a way, especially for a female, a woman, a woman that's determined. It doesn't matter. You're going to get it done. Or even worse, sewing machines due to the noise their tiny engines made. But the women of the 588th ignored the taunts and despite the odds, turned the plane's shortcomings to their advantage. Yeah. The planes at maximum speeds were far below the stall speeds of any of the German fighters, giving them a tight turning circle they were almost impossible to hit. 
they were susceptible to small arms fire and anti-aircraft guns, so their strategy was to attack in threes with a navigator in each plane. At her signal, the pilot would cut the engines and swoop in slowly, silently, dropping their bombs, dealing death from above. Unexpected, brilliant. undetected, stealth perfected. That's brilliant. If necessary, the other two would draw fire from the fighters or from the ground. They slept during the day and rose at dusk to take their vengeance on the invaders. This unnatural bravery and their stealth tactics earned them their title, the Night Witches. I have never heard of this before, but this is amazing. This is, um, like, I am so impressed right now and I have so much respect for these women. The German ace, Johannes Steinhoff said, we simply couldn't grasp that the Soviet airmen that caused us the greatest trouble were in fact women. These women feared nothing. And that's time for a song. Mm -hmm. no, and just say this music is awesome this song i feel like i could really jam to like burn it up and just lose my mind i've said that i don't know if i said it to the last sabaton 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 reaction or not but this is awesome like i'm just so still at this moment like moved by the story aspect i'm not completely in the song like i would normally be uh but this is so cool. Deviation, undetected, still perfected. Also losing ground, retreat into the sound. Death is in the air. Suddenly a bear's come curving on your face. Strike the wish is there. Target bound from around, that old sound from the battle grass. This is saving high. Lord Gina awaits to feed them at the gates. Live to fight and lie. Canvas wings of them. Prepare to meet your fate. Night bomber regiment with 188. Undetected, unexpected, wings of glory, tell the story. Deviation, deviation, undetected, still perfect. because I haven't paused in a second. This is this music is fantastic. And the story, this might be one of my favorite things, although I've liked everything. I don't know. This is this is definitely up there. Thirty-two women, both pilots and navigators, never came home. The 588th became highly decorated and respected, flying more than 23,000 sorties, wow. dropping over 3,000 tons of bombs. Wow. 
23 Night Witches were awarded the Hero of the Soviet Union, although they were disbanded just six months after the war and not allowed to fly in the victory parade given their planes were so slow. From 1956, after she retired from active service, their commissar, Yevdokia Rashkevich, took it upon herself to find the site of every single one of her girls that was downed, to mark the place and to pay her respects to each one of the incredibly brave night witches. Wow. I don't know what I can say. I said so. I already said things during the video. The I, I love and I'm grateful for Sabaton taking the time to bring pieces of history to a, a, an audience because I, well, I can't speak for everyone's education, but there are a lot of things that aren't studied or gotten. Um, so maybe it wasn't taught in the school or it was taught in the school, but not in a way that people remember. Either way, there are all kinds of things, gems in history and, you know, not so good things in history, but it's good to know about things to learn from them, like learn the good and the bad that come out of different things in history, you know? Uh, so I love that they take the time to do that and they're able to make fantastic music to the theme of whatever the historical thing is they're talking about. I need to say something other than thing, but hopefully you know what I mean. That was fantastic. I love the story. I love the song and I love the video. Thank you so much for the suggestion. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you next time. Have a good one.